Hey guys, so we've got three parts to today's workout. They're all for time. Starting with the longest one, it's 10 rounds for time of 10 swings um, with either that kettlebell, dumbbell or bag, whatever you've got, and then 20 mountain climbers. There's a 12 minute cap on that one. The second workout is eight rounds for time with a 10 minute cap. And you've got 10 high pulls uh, with your object and then 20 jumping lunges. And then finally guys, the six rounds for time with an eight minute cap, 10 clean and jerk with your object and then 20 drop squats. Sweet. So it should get faster as you go along guys. Um, let's see how you go. Starting off with an amen EMOM, you've got bear crawl, table rocks, a frog glute bridge, and then uh, plank shoulder taps. As always, you wanna spend about 40 seconds on these guys. Um, there might be a couple of movements in there you're not quite sure of, so I'll take you through them now. So bear crawl, as always guys, keeping the hips up nice and high, load the shoulders, and you're just gonna walk back and forward. You can either do lengths or, um, as I say, reverse it back and down, depending on your space. The table rocks, guys. So you're gonna flip it around the other way. Um, hands can even be facing out or facing away from you. And what you're looking to do is basically create a tabletop position. So shoulder level with the hips and the knees, and then you're gonna drop your hips down and drive up. Your hips down and drive up. Cool. Um, your, what's it called? Frog, that's it, frog glute bridges. Um, so very similar to a normal glute bridge, guys, but you're just gonna pop your feet um, together and your knees to the ground in that frog leg position. And this is just gonna uh, engage the glutes a little bit more. So keeping those feet together, you're gonna drive your hips up and down. Boom. Squeeze the abs and your bum at the top and just get your hips as high as you possibly can and then drop it down low. And then you'll flip it around for your plank shoulder taps. Same hand, same shoulder. Okay, so two rounds of that guys for the eight minutes and then we'll start our workout. So the 10 swings, um, as I say, if you've got a normal dumbbell or kettlebell, great guys. If not, you can use your bag. Um, as always guys, just pop your feet outside the object, hinge from the hip and swing. Okay, so you probably wanna do a Russian if you're inside guys or if you've got like a bag like me, um, just because it's easier to control. Uh, but if you can go all the way ahead, overhead for an American, if you've got a space or kit, then please do so. Um, then you'll go into your mountain climbers. So down onto the ground, knees up to the elbows. So 10 swings and 20 of those for 10 rounds as fast as you can. Um, second part guys, so 10 high pulls and then your 20 jumping lunges. So back to your object, feet just outside. And this time you're going to dip and hinge and pull up nice and high. Making sure the elbows come high and outside and that as you hinge down, you're push, pushing your hips back and down, keeping it nice and straight and then pulling high. You want to come up, as I say, because of my bag, normally you'd aim for about your sternum, but I'll probably aim for about my chin just because I've got a rucksack. And then your jumping lunges, so knee kisses the ground and you're just going to jump and switch. As I say, any knee trouble, just go for a normal lunge, okay? And then the last one, so 10 clean and jerk, and then 20 drop squats. So your clean and jerk, um, as I say, unless you've got a bar, guys, it'll be a single arm, so up to the shoulder, and then press. Oh, and then you're gonna alternate sides. And then the drop squats, guys, so you stand with your feet underneath your hips and just drop into the bottom of a squat. So kind of like a jump squat, but instead of accelerating up um, from that squat, you're looking at dropping into the bottom of it and then standing back with the feet underneath the hips. Um, as I say, time caps on there guys, but try and beat them. Try and get into classes because it'll be an awesome race. Any questions, give us a shout. Have a good day guys.